A Shelby County man is behind bars after authorities say he plotted to sexually assault and murder a child. Now, this is a twisted, twisted plan that was thwarted thanks to the help of several law enforcement agencies, including two right here in East Texas. KDK's Matt Thibodeau has how agents were able to intervene. This case is um, probably one of the most unusual and most disgusting cases I've ever seen. Sheriff Wayne Ivey of Brevard County, Florida, described what 21-year-old Alexander Nathan Barter had done online in a press conference. The investigation started when Brevard County authorities found an online ad posted by Barter. And I will quote the ad, I would like to try necrophilia and cannibalism and see how it feels to take a life. An undercover investigation was launched with Florida and East Texas authorities working together alongside federal authorities. Sheriff Ivey continues, through messages, Barter made it clear he was serious and wanted to commit the atrocious acts on a child. Undercover agents informed Barter they were willing to travel, to which Barter asked them to meet them at his home in northern Shelby County. In his chat, he had discussed that he lived in the woods, um, and uh, that is exactly where the arrest took place and his home was um, uh, quite deeply embedded in the woods. There, Barter came out with a knife and plastic bags, not expecting undercover agents. He was then arrested and taken into federal custody. He actually thanked the agents that were involved in the investigation for stopping him because he was unable to stop himself. That's the individual that we're talking about. Matt Thibodeau, KETK News. And this note to this uh, news story there. Today, Barter went before a judge where he was ordered to have a psychiatric evaluation. He is continuing to be held in a federal custody. No timetable has been set for when that evaluation must be done.